Okay, so it's almost time. We're actually getting closer to the time of when everything starts. As soon as, as soon as I'm able to like make a thumbnail based off of this, I will. Well, not a thumbnail. As soon as I'm able to like just bring this up like in full screen right here, I will do that. But they're not letting me yet. I guess they're waiting until like when they their, their premiere starts. I was thinking that they were like I have to remember they don't do live streams for Pokemon Presents anymore. It's only premieres. That's how they do it. Whereas like when the Nintendo did the partner showcase, they just upload it. It's like oh hey here it is. That's it. But yeah, this is the premiere, so it should be starting up real soon. It's nine o'clock, so it should be starting up like any second now. So I'm just waiting for it at this point. And let's see. Alright. Alright, here it is. There we go. Alright. Alright. Here we are. We have that we have that that cheeky YouTube premiere. That like the music and everything that they do. All right, so we're getting there. It's almost it's almost time. It is almost time. Oh my god. Let's actually um do this. Here we are. We're getting closer to it. Let's go. Here we go. Hello everyone. I'm Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. Alright. In today's Pokemon Presents, we will be sharing information on several of our games, including the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. But before that, I'm happy to share some news about the Pokemon World Championships that will be held in London, UK. That's this true, year, yeah. From August 18th to August 21st. That's coming up. Please have a look at this video. All right. Hello, Pokemon trainers. I'm Chris Brown from the Pokemon Company International, and I'm delighted to share with you updates on our annual Pokemon World Championships. All right. After three years, our global community will come together August 18th to 21st in London for not only intense Pokemon battles, but also to be together, celebrating old friendships and creating new ones, all in the spirit of friendly competition. We are expecting thousands of players the sad to, part about this to compete in this year's trading is game, that video game, and Pokemon Tournament there, Deluxe events. There weren't Many any champi World long Championships earning their invitation in 2020, 2021. Years, and we are thrilled to learn who will earn the title of World Champion in 2022. This year, we are also adding many new elements to the show, beginning Yeah, it's the last year for it, actually. Please join me in welcoming Pokemon Go, where nearly 100 players will compete across two age divisions, and Pokemon Unite. Yeah, they're... 16 teams from 11 regions... They're going to wrap up um, Pokemon Tournament have battled all year for, for their um, to Worlds. the title of the very first world champion in these new categories. We also have a few Yeah, Pokemon Unite, of course, they would. ...fans attending in person including our largest ever Pokemon Center World's pop-up shop. For those unable to attend in person, you can follow all the action from wherever you are on our dedicated live streams for each product, including coverage of every championship match for each age division. Pokemon tournaments are held around the world, and we hope the competition at the World Championships inspire many new players to make new friends through battle. I do have a question. And one more thing. It's my honor to unveil Hold up. for fans today our new Pokemon World Championships Pikachu trophy. Take a look. All right. But, like, did they really need to put Pokemon World Championship news here? Like, I feel like that could be in a separate video. Trophy looks cool, though. Thank you. We look forward to seeing you in London. And now, I would like to hand it back to Mr. Utsunomiya. Thank you very much, Mr. Brown. All right, With what's the next? Pokemon World Championships returning after three years. Please look forward to exciting battles to keep you on the edge of your seats. All right. Now, I'd like to share some news about a few of our games. All right, what type of games? 
Uh, Pokemon Go. For the Go. first time in three years, we held in-person Pokemon Go Fest events in Berlin and Seattle. And this weekend, we will be holding an event in Sapporo, Japan. Ah. Mysterious creatures known as Ultra Beasts have appeared in Oh, uh, yeah, because they're in Gen 7 and now. these Ultra Beasts will all gather together during the Pokemon Go Fest 2022 finale event. It will be held on August 27th. The finale is a global event that can be enjoyed by trainers wherever they are in the world. Trainers will be able to encounter Pokemon they may not normally see right, in the wild. Right. They can also encounter the mythical Pokemon Shaman by completing special research. Will you be able to help re contend with the Ultra Beasts? And you have to purchase a ticket just to do it. And what has become of Professor Willow, who was sucked into Ultra Space through an Ultra Wormhole? Stay tuned for the story's conclusion. Alright then. Additionally, Daily Adventure Incense has been added to the game. It's a special incense that can be used once a day and lasts for 15 minutes. It can attract Pokemon not normally seen in your area, and rumors say it might even attract legendary Pokemon. Wait, legendary? Use Daily Adventure Incense for a 15-minute adventure every day. Over the past six years, we've seen Pokemon from every region debut All right. in Pokemon Go. There are now over 700 Pokemon you can register to the Pokedex. Whether you're making new friends at Pokemon Go Fest or having heated battles at the Pokemon World Championships, the entire world is the stage for Pokemon Go, and our adventures are just getting started. Alright. Pokemon Unite. Pokemon Unite, the hot app for Nintendo Switch and mobile devices. Yep, yeah, there it is. There's the one year anniversary in Pokemon Unite has continued to grow and evolve since its release one year ago. In celebration of its I need to get back into playing this. We're adding not only new Pokemon and features to the game, but also many events and campaigns. I need to collect all the anniversary stuff when I can. Pick battle Pika Party will begin today, August 3rd. Huh. In this special oh, wow. of quick battle in celebration of our first anniversary, That's pretty neat. all Pokemon on the field, both wild and players, are Pikachu. We hope you join in the festivities. Okay. That's fine. Additionally, Buzzwool will be joining yep, the night battle starting today, August 3rd. Buzzwool is an all-rounder that can grapple opposing Pokemon and launch them into the air. But Buzzwool is so buff, it's not even funny. Ability, beast boost, which temporarily increases Buzzwool's movement speed and basic attack speed each time it knocks out <laughs> opposing Pokemon. It's hard to believe something like that is a Pokemon. This first anniversary is just the start of what's to come in Pokemon Unite. Okay. We're planning more events for September as well, so please stay tuned. Ah, Tyranitar's gonna be the next one after that. And we're gifting Unite licenses in Hollowware for Pikachu, Lucario, Blastoise, Snorlax, and Sylveon in celebration of the first anniversary. I just gotta log in. I have until October 12th, so I can just log in whenever. But fuck Tencent, though. Wait, what's this? Wait, it's red. Is this Pokemon Masters? Ah, uh, yeah. Of course it is. I know people who like this game, but I don't. I don't care for it, to be honest. Oh, that makes sense. Alright. Oh, they just they just went right through with it. There's Mewtwo. Wait, what? What's this? Looks like Mewtwo's back in the Pokemon Cafe, Cafe remix. remix game, and it's hungry. Make delicious drinks and dishes with your this Cafe This is this is still a thing, to a really. Time. Once you make a lot of delicious drinks and dishes in one minute cooking to fill Mewtwo up, it can join your staff. Uh. Here are some hints on how to play the one minute cooking puzzle mode to satisfy Mewtwo. Tip one. Gather great staff. Mewtwo likes oh to order God. small plates, so gather staff that specialize in small plates. 
Pikachu, Squirtle, the five-star chef Victini, and the newly arrived Latias are good at those orders. If you want to aim for the high score, I'm sorry, but this is not something Pokemon that I'm really too level. interested in. Go to the Pokemon menu to start raising their wow. staff level by training them. Once your great staff is up to well, the challenge, we'll see what happens it's time to begin one-minute cooking. On to the second tip. Just keep on mixing as much <laughs> as you can. Once you begin one-minute cooking, keep on mixing oh the Pokemon God. to rack up those combos. Use these tips to make delicious drinks and dishes, and you should be able to satisfy Mewtwo. We hope you'll give one minute cooking a try. And there's more. Following Latias. Okay, honest today, question. Who Latias actually plays this game? Here in the future. Wait, Who actually plays more. this? We have a special campaign underway starting today. This is your <laughs> chance to get Victini and Latias on your staff. Pokemon Cafe I do like Latios and Latias, though. No cost to start and is playable on Nintendo Switch like, I downloaded this, but I didn't even play this at all. Wait. Wait. Hold on. Next up, an update on the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. Here we go. Here we go. Now that's what I want to see. Trailer does not reflect actual gameplay experience. The on-screen text and voiceovers. Alright. Okay. Finally, the stuff we actually care about. Exactly. Attention, please. Yeah. Today, we begin... The Treasure Hunt. Travel across Paldea. Get to know the region. There's not going to be voice acting, though. It's just for the trailer. But that said, holy crap, look at that. Abundant nature. Yo, let me ride on that. The rich culture. Look at that. There's a lot of cool Pokemon here, too. Where will you go? Did they finally get this region a name? Who will you meet? Because I forgot that they did. Yo, I I like that professor that looks like Isla from Chrono Trigger. Yeah, let's go. Journey together. Motorcycles. Grow together. Grow together. All right. Find something to treasure. Okay. Ah, oh, wow. What? Is that the gimmick? Crystal Empire Pokemon? Let the treasure hunt begin. November 18th. And now let's see if they talk about the details. We're now starting to get a clearer picture of your adventures to come in the Paldea region. Paldea, okay. I'd like to dive a little deeper into the information presented, so let's take a closer look together, shall we? Alright. Like these Pokemon are crystals. The newest titles in the Pokemon series are the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. These titles will be open world RPGs, a first for the Pokemon open series. Open world RPGs. Sprawling landscapes and vibrant towns weave together to form the Paldea region, where your new adventure will unfold. These are the legendary Pokémon, Coridon and Miraidon. Oh, nice. You rely on one of them as a partner in your adventure. Climb on, and together you'll dash across grassy fields, 
move across water, and glide through the sky. They both look really nice. I actually like both Your of them. Your partner can change forms as needed while you explore every nook and cranny of the region with them. All right. You will be enrolling at a certain academy as a student. And a special independent study project awaits you. The treasure right. hunt. Through it, you'll embark on a journey to find treasure of your own. Here All right. In Paldea. Cool. Three grand stories are waiting for you. One story will revolve around the familiar gym battles. You'll go to eight Pokemon gyms and aim for the champion rank. In these games, there is no set path you must take when challenging the gyms. Right. Chart your very own course along Victory Road. So you can just go wherever you want now. All right. That's cool. The other two stories you'll experience hold many surprises and discoveries as well. Which story will you begin with? How will you progress through them? It is all up to you. Okay. The cast of characters. Professor Sada and Professor Churro research legends passed on in the Paldea region. Mr. Clavel is the director they both look of the great. academy you'll I kind of like Sada more. And Mr. Jacques is your homeroom teacher who teaches biology. Jacques. You'll have your battle-loving friend, Nimona. That's your rival? And you'll meet Arvin, an upperclassman and a great cook. Oh, cool. There's also Penny, a shy student in your grade. Oh! There are gym leaders, too. Like Grusha, the ice type gym leader. Mmm. The people you Yo, meet. Yo, that guy looked like Mr. Satan sure with a dapper hair. Many different species of Pokemon also call the Paldea region home. <laughs> this Pokemon Wait, what is the, the Paldea Whooper! regional form. Of Whooper! It ground lives type? on the land and covers like its, its body with a poisonous ground? film. A poison. Fido are delightfully squishy Pokemon that are smooth to the touch. Fido. And here's Satitan, which has a large body and a hard horn that can freeze its surroundings. Of course, we also have the Pokemon from which you'll choose your first partner. All right. Sprigatito, Fuecoco, and Quaxley. Quaxley, Quaxley, easily, Quaxley. Enjoy meeting lots of Pokemon. And complete your But I do like them all, though. Foy Coco looks great, and so does Sprigatito. Okay, what's the multiplayer details? By using the Union Circle, you can enjoy co-op play with up to three friends. What? You can go look for Pokemon you haven't yet discovered. Or even ride together to race across the map. There better not be a catch. Enjoy all the there better not be a catch. Has to offer with family and friends. Because co-op is actually pretty cool, but there better not be a catch to that. Oh. The terrestrial phenomenon makes Pokemon Terrasal. shine like gems. Turn your Pokemon to a gem. So crystal. That's the gimmick right there. All Pokemon in the Paldea region are able to terrestrialize, which can provide a boost to a Pokemon's type and make its moves stronger. Some Pokemon will change type when they terrestrialize. Oh boy. What type they become seems to depend on that Pokemon's Terra type. Oh wow. Okay. For example, an Eevee would typically this could be cool. remain normal type after terrestrializing, but there could be Eevee that become grass or water type after terrestrializing. What? Really? We hope you'll try nice. to catch Pokemon with rare Terra types. Okay. Pokemon that have rare Terra types are more likely to appear in Terra raid battles. Wait, raid battles are back? You can challenge Terra Pokemon in these battles with up to three other trainers. At least we know this raid battles are back. Kind of raid battle Good. Where you can attack or heal with your own timing without having to wait for your allies. I definitely like the visual style here way more than it, the visual style here is way better than Sword and Shield. Hand in these 
after you successfully defeat a Terra Pokemon, you'll get the opportunity to catch it for yourself. Nice. We raid battles. We're gonna raid. Raid battles. I have a feeling that this You've is this is all it. The things you love about Pokemon while evolving the adventure you can have in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. We hope you look forward to the day you set out on your adventure. Alright. The Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games are available to pre-order at participating retailers All right. now. Cool stuff. Your independent study in the Paldea region uh, begins Pikachu. in two months. We eagerly await your enrollment. That's all for today's presentation. Thank you very much for tuning in and watching. I had a feeling that was going to be it. I had a feeling that was going to be it. Um, so, Pokemon Presents.